Hi guys, this video is brought to you by Outtalk.co.uk for your post, pre-match and Sheffield Wednesday discussions with fellow Wednesdayites. Hi guys and welcome to the Fulham Sheffield Wednesday preview. Now this is three away games on the trot we're going to have and last year our away record wasn't brilliant so let's hope we can pick on it. But Carlos has said the team starting to look good, a uh, real unit coming together. The whole thing with 48 was an internal thing. It seems like that's hopefully going to be put to bed at last. Thank God. Uh, and Carlos said it's a red card from the club. But let's just start with what we need to do. Uh, Fulham got a draw against Leeds uh, on Tuesday, as did we against Sunderland. They also got a draw against Reading, as we did on against QPR and they got a draw against Norwich so so far their season started with a lot of draws and one win in the uh, cup so it'll be interesting to see how we get on in this game I'm hoping we can start well because that's been our biggest issue at the minute we've not been starting games as well as we should be in my personal opinion we've had this whole kind of stutter in his heart now the other thing that's been uh, a bit of debate is the George Hurst thing a five million bid but I'm going to do a separate video on that in uh, in a bit. So, yeah, hopefully we can get all three points in this game. Uh, it'd be good to see if we can get uh, Winnell again starting. Maybe Winnell or Fl and Fletcher. Uh, it'll be interesting to see how we play. There was a big thing today with uh, Top Sport saying... Uh, oh, pardon me. Saying about you buy Boyd, you don't play him and you play him in the diamond. The diamond seemed to work for us at the moment but I am of the opinion we've bought Boyd and we've not started him yet and it just seems like like come on he's a premiership player you said he was your number one target to get let's get him in the squad not moaning us up but I would like to see him in the squad soon so let's see what happens and hopefully we can get all three points don't forget to have your say at altalk.co.uk after the match